took a bank, let's say two years back, just to give you a sense. And uh, we've invested in technology fairly early, uh, right from a microfinance bank. And uh, for us here, uh, it's been relatively simple. The platform has been set, so we kind of created the foundation for us to grow. And uh, and there's a lot of enablers in technology. For example, for us, many of our uh, people are feet on street. So mm. uh, making them comfortable with technology has been, you know, the biggest challenge. I would call it. It's a mixed breed, so it's a slow journey. It's both a challenge and something which is an imperative for us to uh, uh, us to grow. Earlier, the turnaround time for any loan application, so it's around seven to eight days was the average time that it used to take for uh, loans to be disbursed. Uh, what was then done is, how do you digitalize the whole process? Which essentially meant that the field force used to actually take a device, enter the basic data, and the loans uh, sanction, the credit check, all that is done right out there. Mm -hmm. There's obviously multiple maker and checker, but everything is digital in a fashion that from the seven to eight days kind of a turnaround time, it comes right down to four days. Mm. So that's been phenomenal because the productivity of the entire staff increases, the ability to give loans in a shorter turnaround time increases. So that's been one of the largest uh, uh, and successful implementations from a technology standpoint that came into play. The, uh, the rest, I would call it more about creating the foundation. So. I mean, we've got the core banking from state of the art, uh, you know, from Fennecal. Uh, we've got CRM next. Uh, I would call it that one of the things that we really did differently from probably many of the banks because is that we got CRM at the center of the universe. Uh, so mm -hmm. any customer that is onboarded is uh, it's through CRM. So you have a single view of this uh, customer, be it a loan, be it a deposit, be it any kind of product, all the onboarding happens through the CRM and uh, mm -hmm. therefore the CRM is the front end and you have a single view of the customer. Both we have a single view of the customer and the customer also has a single view of his relationship with the bank. So we are dreaming of growing 10x in the next four years. Uh, what it essentially translates into is preparing the foundation for new product launches. So we've got the core platform, so it's a no-brainer that the core platform will deliver uh, those new products. The second thing is about uh, going digital in a big way because we need to get the cost of acquisition low. And for that, uh, our thought process is about building strategic partnerships with uh, many of the players. So uh, what it translates to from a technology initiative is uh, the API banking. So that's something that we're looking for as an initiative. Second thing is we've got around 40 lakh customers with us and many of them are uh, uh, purely in the asset business, but it's data. And uh, using this data to find out as to what kind of cross-sell can be done is the second leg that we want to do. So we're trying to go statistical and look at how we can build a statistical scorecard to improve the, you know, the credit approvals and uh, we're leveraging analytics for that. So these are the two big uh, areas that we're looking at. Uh, API banking and usage of analytics to do both acquisition, which is from a cross-sell point of view, mm -hmm. as well as from the analytics point of view.